In this video, we're going to look at the Mackie Master Fader view pages or user pages. We have a typical festival setup with drums, bass, guitar channels, dedicated keys, dedicated acoustic, 3DRs across the front, a floating mic, which is a wireless, which is useful if the MC brings up the promoter or a radio DJ to interview. A stage right vocal, a lead vocal, a stage left vocal, and a drum vocal. An MC wireless and two DJ channels. The first view group I like to create is the tweener singer-songwriter group. We will assign to this group the acoustic guitar the lead vocal, the MC, and a DJ channel. This really clears up the clutter and makes mixing and finding the channels a lot easier than scrolling through 32 channels to get to the acoustic and the lead vocal. Next, let's create a view group for the straight ahead rock band in group B. Here we'll assign all the drum channels minus the tracks, our bass. This typical setup will not have keys, an acoustic, fiddles, mandolins, or anything else. We'll assign the MC and a DJ channel as well. Let's have a quick look at view group B. The goal here is to reduce the clutter and not see channels we are not using. By pressing the preamp section of a channel, we can see which group it's assigned to. We could also assign the channel to different view groups from this page, but it's a lot quicker to do it from the assigned section. Every scenario is different. Go ahead and make up your own view groups as you see fit.